catching up with Malcolm Thomas here on campus, San Diego State University. The big game coming up on Wednesday, the Aztecs and BYU. Malcolm, first question I want to ask you is about campus life. You grew up in San Diego, went to Pepperdine originally, made that choice to transfer back to Montezuma Mesa. When you and Ty Shelley made that call, was this anything close to what you imagined it would be? No, you know, I never imagined playing, you know, for a top five team. I don't think Tyrone did either. Well, Tyrone probably because coming out of high school, he's highly recruited, but I never imagined this. I just wanted to win, you know, and coming here, I knew I would win more than I did at Pepperdine, but never imagined playing for a top five team. You know, when I talk to you guys, it just seems like what happened with, with you as a team last year, your tournament run, the ability to get to the NCAAs, to play a team in Tennessee that wound up going all the way to the eight and, and play them so close. How much of that has really been a wave that you guys have, have really rode all the way through this year? You know, last year it, it was tough losing to Tennessee when we were so close. But after the game, you know, we knew we played well with the SEC team, which is one of the top conferences. And, you know, we worked on things that we needed to work on during the off season, And I think everybody put it in effect this year, and, and now we're 20-0. and 0. I asked you guys about this at the podium, but as a team, what do you feel is at stake Wednesday at the Marriott Center? Um, not too much. You know, BYU's always been tough. Last year they were tough. Um, just two good teams playing each other in a good conference, and... You know, somebody has to win, so hopefully it's us. <laughs> you know, the old sports cliche says, don't get too high, don't get too low. How are the 20-0 and 0 Aztecs handling being in, in these lofty heights? Um, everybody's level-headed. Nobody pays attention to it, really. Um, it's a good thing being 20-0, and 0, and hopefully we can be 30-0 the next 10 games. But, you know, everybody's going to play hard, and my team is just ready to play BYU on Wednesday. Let me ask you a last question about poise. I think a lot of times going to the Marriott Center, traveling to Provo and playing BYU there requires a great deal of poise from SDSU student athletes. You won't say that it's five on eight sometimes. Maybe I would say that it's five on eight sometimes. What do you guys have to do to mentally stay strong when things get extremely adverse around you? Maybe the whistles are going against you. Uh, just become a team. You know, the crowd's going to be talking to us. There's the elevation. They run hard. We're just going to have to actually be a team and talk to each other, keep each other mentally focused, and we'll be ready. Malcolm, looking forward to it, man. I think everybody in town is looking forward to Wednesday night, and congrats on a great run so far. Thank you.